very important to note. Always drink water. Water is free. SeaWorld on July the 4th, first thing in the morning, or first at park open because I've never done a road drop here, but also I want to get my scan in for the day and just kind of see what SeaWorld's like on July the 4th. So far, busy. So there's the line going to Aquatica, although it's not open just yet, at least I don't think it's open yet. Here's the line to get into SeaWorld. It's going all the way back to the sign. The park is now open. Do the pledge to the flag way back there. So it must be 10.30. Alright, so I made it in. Actually not bad. Once again, I forgot. I hate that I forgot my watch because I don't know what time it is. Instead of going to the lounge, I'm actually going to go get some uh, see if Duck Donuts is open. I know it's overpriced, but it might be worth it. And I see some Duck Donuts. I haven't had... Actually, I need to drink some water. I brought water with me. I just haven't drank any. I thought it was $3. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to try it out. At least just need a donut to hold me over. I see I haven't even fully opened the park yet. Hang on, can I zoom? Yeah, I can zoom now. Yeah, there were, uh, I guess people are lining up, getting ready to go into the park. But I have my duck donuts that I will be enjoying. Don't have a fork though, so I'm gonna put my camera down. Yeah, Grover talking over me. Oh yeah, they haven't opened the parks just yet. They're pathway to Journey to Atlantis is closed off right now. I saw a Waybreaker with people on it, which I guess it's 10.30, but it's crazy that they don't have uh, this side open yet. There it goes. Zoom in some. Oh, well, they're testing a uh, tidal surge. Yeah, getting into the park wasn't terrible. Um, I got here probably a little after 10, or driving in a little after 10. When I pulled into VIP, it looked like the line was all the way back to the end of VIP. And I'm not sure if they just hadn't opened up all the lines yet, but I parked, walked over, the line had died down significantly, and it was already up to where you could see the SeaWorld uh, logos and whatnot. Luckily, there were enforcing the platinum gold membership line so that made me that made it even faster so it only took me probably 15 minutes to get in the park i was gonna say 30 but i think i got duck donuts before that so far decent day Review of Duck Donuts here. I've only had it twice. Not not here in general. Like I've only been to their stores like twice. Uh, I like Duck Donuts. I like donuts. I like ducks. Put them together. No, but seriously, it was it was a good donut. It's definitely overpriced, but it's priced for being in the park, wanting something sweet, like I was. I didn't have breakfast this morning, but it was good. It's not. It's they're made fresh. If you try to eat it right away, you're probably gonna burn yourself. The only thing is I wish they had forks there. I'm not sure, I probably could have asked for one. I'm not sure if they had them in the back somewhere. But I got the s'more donut and it was good. Uh, it tasted, tasted like a s'more, had the uh, um, chocolate marshmallow flavor as well as the graham crackers sprinkled in. Uh, would I pay that price again uh, if I didn't have to? No, if I'm coming here in the morning without breakfast, yes. <laughs> 
do kind of like this shirt. Ooh, and this is in current. Although that one's kind of low cut. Maybe I don't like that shirt. <laughs> this is in current though, which they do have the current double discount. So and I do have $25 C-Bucks. So maybe. Catapult Falls is still closed. It's a bummer for July 4th crowd. Big Breaker, uh, the Bay of Play, and then Steel Ill are the only things that are open right now. So it might be hard to see, but this is why I wanted to try and get here early. Looks like it's backed up past the highway on Westover Hills, and the other two roads are also backed up. Getting here around 10 o'clock was a good call. Now this is nice. I've never really played with it, but just a little light, bright board. At night, it actually lights up, so that makes it even cooler. But they did open up this part of the park now, so I'm gonna go in and get my pass scanned. We're going to 8 p.m. Nice and cold in here. <laughs> it is crazy. I do love coming in here and checking out the pictures each day. But also just look how there's nothing around when they were constructing the park. Oh, except for right over there. There was stuff. I just don't like that anymore. I think it's just solid colors, or it's not that colorful. I'll have to go back and check. Despite how crazy it was this morning, did not look like that. Some nightmare fuel right there. <laughs> Actually, I do wish they would bring that back. <laughs> I never got to see this. I love the Animal Actor Show at uh, Universal Studios. So I am super bummed. <laughs> that actually looks very similar. Some of the uh, set designs that is. Style boards. And the hydro-powered shows that we never saw either. This was... What was it? The SeaWorld Express? Or Shamu Express? That used to be where Boxcar Grover is. Grover Super Boxcar Derby. That's what it's called. Yeah, there's a picture of it. Same colors. Same, same color rails and everything. talking about this the other day how oh, I think the house used to be this house used to be where Catapult Falls is uh, both of us don't have good memory they're not not don't want to say good memories of but just like we don't harbor it they didn't bring this guy back it's awesome guitar apparently I mean, they might. They brought these these characters back. 
for this solar eclipse. Why does it look sunny though? It wasn't sunny. Maybe that was the uh, annual eclipse. check-in for day 26 um, the guy initially was gonna say come back at 7 cuz you have a 24-hour lockout which is dumb but um, I just told him please just enter me in the extra computer like everyone else has been doing and just update my number because why the park had didn't Unless they did, I don't see anything in the instructions that says wait 24 hours before you come back and check in. And see what is surprisingly empty right now. Uh, my guess is everyone's probably still parking and going to Aquatica or something else. I don't know. I'm sure it'll be way crowded for the fireworks show today, which I'm not staying for because I'm going to be spending time with my family. My parents are having a big get together. So I'll be head over to that after this today. See. Oh, the fans too. Ooh, nice. On top of the other fans they have. Ah, the cool zone. Well, these ones aren't working. Wonder if that's for the rest of the summer or just uh, for today. One of the few times I've actually seen this running. say whoever's idea was to care if these were already here just need to be replaced or just add on to it. it was genius thank you so much nice little fourth of july uh photo opportunity I'm surprised there's not more people out taking photos with it well, these guys are swimming oh, must be nice I believe these are the river otters. I just want to pet that belly. Pet the belly. Checking out these guys. And, hang on, let me get across this boulder. I see a new little one right there. Good job, Seymour. 
Sea lions have long pectoral flippers they can use to propel themselves through the water. They can typically cruise around 14 miles an hour and reach top speeds of up to 20 in short bursts. These are the same muscles they can use to support their entire body weight. Oh my god. Good job, Seymour. Come on, let's show off your strength and agility. I got out of there. <laughs> Luckily the line to get in isn't that long, but getting in is hectic. But I am heading out, looking at some of the lines here at Aquatica. They look very long. They don't have the uh, drop one going. That's, that's a bummer, that's my favorite one. Hey there, so I actually did go back and film the fireworks on July 5th and I was gonna do it in the park but it was way too busy <laughs> made me realize probably what it would look like had I stayed for the full July 4th day but I did go and record them in a spot that I figured out where I could probably see the fireworks fireworks were actually pretty good and so uh, let's just jump to that
That was just my day at SeaWorld on July 4th, or the morning of July 4th, I should say. Um, now I'm just gonna go home. It's a fun day. Um, crowds weren't as busy as I thought it would, except for the ending there and getting in. The new Sea Lion show, it's not, I'll, I'll be honest, it's not as good as the other one, as the previous one. But it's still a good show. Still enjoy it. Still love seeing the sea lions. And Carol's not in this video because she's uh, actually had to go to Marfa, be a photographer in a wedding. But uh, hopefully I'll get her in, um, sorry, I'm making sure no one's behind me, in some more videos soon. But yeah, thank you for watching. As always, hydrate. And until next time, bye. actually have two extra ticket takers out here. That is crazy.